<laughs> Brand new whip, what's poppin'? Make the play for the first out of the inning. Now with the plate, Phil Ordonez. He flew out in his last at bat. Hit softly down the line at first, but a foul ball here, 0 and 1. One out, nobody on. Nope. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. Hey, that backdoor breaking ball just missed. He had a chance to run it to 0 2. Sent out to straightaway center field. I got, I Cortez got, I got. will wait on it, and that's out number two. Digging in for his second at bat, Sammy Alaniz. He singled his last time up. Swing and a miss, but he's right on here. One strike. And it's quickly 0 and 2. Yeah, I'm definitely from fastball. Two here, out, but... nobody on. Two down, two down. Are you now? Nah, it's, it's gonna be a slaughter. Hit the other way out toward right field. Right fielder giving chase. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Well, my team do garbage. Wow, I was relieved. Wow. Have fun. Wow, we're getting destroyed now. Wow. Alley allowed one score, so. Any further than the fifth inning to see where this game was decided. Yeah, that's guess what? Guess what inning? What that was that? Guess what that inning was? The one I got released. Eight to three is today's final. The West took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Rodney Helland takes home the win. So that'll just about do it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. Here now our final line score. First. First. How many strikeouts did I get that game? Only two? Man. Are you, are you watching? Me, no. Oh, my bad. Uh... Or is anyone? I'm oh, not just yet. Hold on. Uh, hey, what's uh, your name on there again? Blaze Busty. I can't. I can't wait to get copyright strike because the music in this game all. I know, right? Yeah, that's not. Cause we got your notification about you going live. Okay, it says it for me too. Hello, baseball fans. Matt Vass. Hey, guys. Mark DeRosa here. Your attention, please. Your attention, please. Let's not get beat living the free this time. Stepping up to of the course. plate, Mikey Grossman. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. <laughs> and here's a fastball called for no strike ball. one. One strike. And it's quickly 0-2. What what pitch should I do, Henry? Huh? What pitch should I do? Carrie Bruce Slaughter. Oh, I, I could curve. Fuck. Nothing in two count Pretty and long. the pitch. Oh, I was trying to say slider. And a good pitch there as this is swung well, the on curve missed for the first out of the ball game. Uh. Wow, he's not messing around right here. Three pitches, three strikes, sit your backside down. Scouts oh, just love this guy's talking stuff. Right after a hitter, and that's exactly what he did there. This guy's I talking some crap. He just said, sit your backside heads, down. Liking what they yeah. see, and I don't blame them. Fouled off. You're definitely you're, you're definitely vulnerable to a slaughter, aren't you? Hey, I'm thinking. You might be. Right here, kid. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Bounced to first. Reined in. And he'll take yeah. it to the bag himself for the out. Oh, pa the plate Pablo now. is up. Pablo Velasquez. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Yikes. And that misses for ball one. Of course, say yikes. That evens it up one and one. 
Here's the pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Ooh, it's uh, no chance to run it down. It's one. a foul ball. One, hit one, on one. the ground to third. He's got it. And oh, the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag, and he'll reach it first. Bruh. So it's a runner hmm. at first as a result of the throwing. That guy error. couldn't make and it. Next will be the power hitting. That guy catcher. couldn't throw it to Ty first base. I'm triggered. Oh, and one the count. <laughs> That's always fun. A swinging oh, strike, and now it's 0 and 2. 0 2 count. You could do just about anything you want right now. Up, down, in, out, hard, soft. Good time to be a pitcher. Velasquez leads off first with a it's pair of right outs here. in the inning. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that is out number three. So no runs on no hits. One error in the inning. Yeah, thanks for the help there, team. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Taylor Foster. Huh. In there, no balls and a strike. Mm, got him out on his front foot. Oh, it's 0-2. I know that feeling. Played 14 years in the big leagues and still can't hit a slider. Fly ball out toward left center field. Bradshaw a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. Hey, we got one here. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Curveball and that misses in the dirt for ball Wait, no. one. My hand is slipped. Yikes. Fun. Bruh. Much too one tardy ball. on the one fastball. Strike. One and one. I think it's safe to say he wasn't ready for the fastball. Wow, was he behind that fastball? Great job on the mound using the curveball to set up the heater. And they could go either way now, I suppose. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out. And it's two up, two down to start the second. So digging in now, Jamie Dowling. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Popped him up. That's... Elias is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Nothing across here this half. Let's go. We finally scored. Damn. There you go. Well. But did you lose again? No, my team. Top of the third only set once. to get underway, and that'll oh. bring in the second baseman, Brandon Ames. Now a big fastball, oh, and he's well behind it with the swing. Hey, if you're able to blow a first pitch fastball by a guy, gotta believe that pitch is coming again right here. Oh, I thought. What if I told you it's not coming again? Well, a swing and a miss as he picks up another <laughs> one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first out. First three to him on the way. Curtis Naylor is Come in on. with one away one now as he swings and misses here at strike one. Fly ball right down the line and left. Left fielder giving chase, and they can't oh, run no, it down. Hey, it's you and him. Give him a the wind up and the open. I'm going to YouTube on here so I can see and your live stream. Swung on and missed his fifth strikeout already, me. and there are two gone in the inning. Now in the box, Mikey right Grossman, now. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Man, that's seven straight strikes to start this inning. He's got a chance at an immaculate inning. Never find the YouTube, man. There's a breaking there ball, but it doesn't quite find the strike zone. The one-one home. Hey! Hey, I don't mind that take right there. That was a nasty breaking ball. Started outside the zone, popped back inside the zone. Good spot. And we we'll have to leave it at that, there. Really? This is strike three, and Fun. that will retire the side. Henry, the ball was like right next to his leg, and he still swung at it. Like I said, fun. And... Are we going to lose? Probably. Yeah, we won. Cool. Pitching and defense game, 2-1, to one, the final score this afternoon. The Central came through when it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Kenny I Jones zero hits. is credited I with the win. Mm -hmm. So that's it for us this afternoon. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You Got six strikeouts, though.
from his former high school coach, who's been acting as his advisor through the process. Now let's see, where are you at, Brent? Welcome back to the Major League Baseball first If I can find the subscribers, will let me. With the first pick, there they are. Detroit Tigers select Henry Soto, a first baseman from the West Region. With the second pick, the Baltimore Orioles. There you are. Patrick Fryer, a relief pitcher from the West Region. With the third pick, the Miami Marlins select Trey Sullivan, a closing pitcher from the West Region. With the fourth pick, the Kansas City Royals select Nick Young, a relief pitcher from the West Region. With the fifth pick, the Toronto Blue Jays select Rick Castellano. A starting pitcher from the West hey, region. Hey, Henry. With the six what? You, you got drafted by the Takis. Oh, well, there we go. Henry Soto. A starting pitcher from the West what? With the 22nd pick, uh, who am I going to? Oh, I'm going to. Oh, I'm going to the Cleveland Indians. I'm going to the Cleveland Indians. Yay. <laughs> After a long and lonely first two days of the MLB draft, this player's wait is finally over. While being selected is a major milestone, new draftees still Who's watching face it? Are you long watching? odds of ever making yeah. it to the big leagues. You're terrible. No. Oh. I'm versing Reggie McLean. Yay. And we're we're free in one. Or we one and three. Oh wait, we're, we were up for one. Oh, cool. Minor League Baseball is live. Reggie McLean. Let's, let's see what right. you got, McLean. At the plate, Billy McGinnis. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. And the pitch. Hey, which one Fouled are away. Akron. Uh. 0-1 delivery. Ball one. Oh. Fellas are visiting hey, team as they take the field after a scoreless top half. They come in trying to rebound after a loss that snapped a modest three-game winning streak. Yeah, Matty, I'm, I, I've been really impressed with this team, especially on the recent road trip, the start to it. They're 3-1 and one after four games, playing really fundamentally sound baseball from offense to defense, pitching. It's all okay. coming together what pitch group. No matters. It's your choice. Oh, I know. I was going to see if you had opinions. Uh, Lifted down the line and left. Hunter. And this will wind up a foul hey, ball. Grounded to third. Fielded cleanly. And the throw to first is in time. One gone. At the plate, Simone Muziani, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Popped him up. Helton over to his right. But it's the pitcher that makes the play. And that's the second. Where are you out of going, the inning. catcher? <laughs> in now, Wander Franco. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. Oh, and they'll start him with a fastball man, that's low that's fast. for ball one. <laughs> Oh. High in the air out to center oh, field. Oh, 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 oh. Mercado is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. We've played an inning. Still nothing, nothing. Still nothing, nothing. Oh, my God, really, team. 
Stepping into the box, Jalen Ortiz. He'll start us out here in the home half of the second. Into the corner and slicing foul. Now the pitch. And he fouls this one off. Jeez. Hey, just you and him. Get him Looking yourself. for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Had him fooled as this has popped up back take behind it, short. It. Clement ball, is calling ball, ball, for ball. it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Digging in now, Bryson Stott. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Oh, and he just blows the fastball by him for strike one. This, I guess this guy wants me to do all fastballs. Off the plate, oh, one crap. ball, one strike. Let's go, fellas, let's go. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Kirby, you're up. Time for Kirby. No, you know, fastball mm -hmm. again. Hey, they want to go fastball again. Okay. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Gonzalez is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. This this coach knows we can't go Cornelius fastball Randolph so much. Comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. Hit down the third baseline. Uh, this gets foul. Big on bridge. What happened? Pitch on the way. Frogger playing. <laughs> Strong isn't really known as the kind of starter that goes deep into games. It's not that he isn't capable. I'm sure he just hasn't been that guy that works deep into games with regularity. Matty V, I'm not sure it's this guy's fault, but I think it's more the fault of the metrics and the way we look at pitchers now, trying to limit the number of pitches. And, and we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Team, please do something. Nice. Nice. We're up 2 nothing. Digging in, Austin Listy took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. In there at the knees as he authors a strike to the leadoff man, nothing and one. Curveball close, but it's one and one. In for a strike, and he jumps ahead one and two now. You know, I think that curveball in the previous pitch had him thinking about getting another one because there's no reason he shouldn't have had a big rip at that fastball. That was right in every hitter's happy zone. The one-two. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off-speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. Mine, mine, mine. Clement backs up a bit and he takes charge for the first out. So coming to the plate, Jose Antequera. He also had three hits in the win last night. Popped him up. Bracho waits on it. I got it, I got it, I got it. Makes the play and there are two gone now. So stepping in, Jack Conley. <laughs> this guy is still looking at a zero in the hit column. So high fly I'll ball headed for the left field corner. You. If it stays hey, there, now. it's gone. I'm on beam, Definitely had oh, the distance. Watch but yourself, it up I see you. I see, I see, I see you. You 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 You see you. You see you. You You see you. You see you. You see you. You see you. Are you now? Look at crap, ready? Sent toward first, but an easy well, play over at first to well, it, and the side nah, is retired. Well, I didn't strike him out, but uh, he's out. Now you got a whole beard with dreadlocks. <laughs> now batting, Billy <laughs> McGinnis. Uh, he got I on just, top I of one and was a ready? shootout victim I'm last time. Hey, we're me. still in the early stages. Oh, 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 hold on, what a stop mm -hmm. in time. And that's a huge play to keep the leadoff man off base. <laughs> Digging in to try it again. Simone Bro, Luziani. I love streaming of uh, MLB. First trip. <laughs> Here, you Here it comes. I'm bad yep. at it. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. I didn't see nothing so good. I'm not going to respond to him streaming. 
This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that it's front not foot actually down early what you think it is. Ready or he's gonna throw it right <laughs> by you. Count is one and two now. Now here it comes. Swing and a miss on the fastball bye bye. that time. Out number two. Stepping in, Wander Franco. So far, 0 for 1 with a fly out. Swing and a miss, 0 and 1. Not shocked by their aggressive nature at the plate today, but they got to change their MO if they're going to compete in this one. Down the third baseline. Two out, nobody on. And they'll try to oh, tip to curve. Who just seen that pitch? In front of the plate and it's that was one a bad pitch. He's been pounding his own with nothing but strikes, but that's an amazing take right there. You start getting into that auto swing mode when you think that guy's going to be around the zone. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. Yeah. And the throw to first ends the inning. Can't start any better than this. He's set down the first. Oh, what map is it? This is what map is it? Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and next it'll oh. be the outfielder, Jalen Ortiz. We're moving through the middle of this ball game right now. <laughs> they want to get things oh, going. How about trying to get some base runners on, or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits Aye. going into this part of the game. Behind 0-2 hey, no now. No outs now. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Fastball Aye. called, strike three, and there's Boom. the first out of the inning. This guy is really locked in on the bump right now. He's just playing good old-fashioned hardball right now. Just rearing back and letting it go. And it seems like this lineup, they don't have an answer for anything he's bringing so far. Bryson Stott is the batter now as he looks at a bowl of 1-0. Oh. And, and a fastball ah. here that's taken for ball two. 2-0 to a guy with this kind of pop, you better be awfully careful because he's going to be swinging out of his one, shoes. One, one. Ground ball right side. And he'll step oh. on first himself for the out. Stepping in, Cornelius Randolph. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Clearly off with his timing on that one. A swinging strike. Hey, not too often we see this hitter come outside his game plan, outside the zone, but that pitch was just so tempting. Please tell me you guys just heard what that guy said. That pitch, that pitch was so tempting. Didn't oh, quite catch the zone there, ball one. Well, this is an approach we've seen him yeah. use effectively lately. Set up the end. Threw it right <laughs> past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends just, the inning. I just struck out Randolph. Yeah. To start Damn. Well, my team did amazing there. A strike out, a hit by pitch, a strike out, and a strike out. As they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. He's watching me. I'm not playing nothing. Hey, I'm, just, uh, there, I'm just watching the uh, last uh, thing for right now. What's up? One and one. One and one. One ball and two strikes to count. It's time for a fastball on 100%. 100% fastball. One and two. Swing and a miss Boom. on the fastball, and that's huh? the first out. He's been in total control out there I today. don't know. Gets the lead off I think it's just hitting a strike okay. out there, and it just seems like we've seen so that's many that's not easy. I was actually and weekly hit balls in this one. Yeah. Jose Antequera comes on with oh, one, one gone here as he looks now. at a called strike one. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. This guy got to get struck out now. That guy's getting tired. Well. And this is popped foul off to the right and back into the seats. And, and Bruh. it's fouled away. Stop swinging. Bases are empty, one man out. And he struck no, him out as no, well. No, so the no, bottom no, of the order no, providing no, little no, resistance no. here and there. Hey, are two I just guess what? I just struck him out, so. Now at the play, Jack Conley Finally. will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with oh, the no. two guys going MLB down baseball. on strikes to start the inning. The 1-0. Oh. Oh. oh, right no. Center. Right oh, yes, is we're good. On the run. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. So another good inning for him on the mound. Please score. Yes, let's go. 
Ow. Last half of the seventh here, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Billy McGinnis. And that's sure. on and Imagine screw. Imagine I know it's at cliche that. and it's tired at times, but a well-located fastball down at the knees is still the best pitch in the game. The one-one pulled high in the air Let's out to go. right field. Call is camped under this it, one. One gone. Seventh inning. Wow, this game is over quick. Digging in once again, Simone Muziati. He's popped out and struck out in his first two plate appearances. Oof. Lifted down the line and left. And oh, yeah, he'll wind up a foul ball. Well, right, do you, did you now, are, you, are you still going to try to go Myrtle with me? Get hard mm, up maybe. the middle. Oh, man, there you go. Yeah, that's a move. base hit. Yeah. So the perfect game bid mm. ends in the and seventh. And that's what Myrtle went to before. Ah, uh, they finally break yeah, we're through for the first I'm going to try to take Kenny this time. So the no-hit bid will oh, end right here. Oh, uh, even though yeah, that man, knows this where you start thinking about that, no, no, you get into the seventh inning, Dero. As a pitcher, you start looking ahead to what might happen. And that donut stares at you from an offensive standpoint as well. This guy's had his A game. You can't deny the fact that he's pitched a heck of a game. But from an offensive standpoint, you never stop grinding to get a crooked number up on that board. So it was a strikeout swinging. Wander Franco becomes the second out of the bottom of the seventh. Jalen Ortiz stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1-0. From the belt, kicks and deals. Oh my God! What am I doing? Base hit. I just saw two hits off. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna. Hey, this might be the best opportunity to at least get on the board. They've been struggling offensively, and they find themselves with two runners on board. Let's see if they can continue it. Nah, they're out. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Ready for another shot now, Cornelius Randolph. We're in the eighth now, and nothing's changed out there on the mound. Well, I've been very impressed with how this oh, starter's going now. about his business, Matt. He's looked really sharp, and it's hard to know if it's had any effect, but getting that early lead from his offense could have really helped settle him in. Call is right there, and he's got it for out number one. Digging in, Austin Listy. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this AB. Ready once again, Jose Antequera. Only four outs remaining for them to try and rally back in this one. No balls in one strike. Two, two. Hit out towards second. Two, two, two. That's through, and he's got his first Ooh. base hit. He's one for three. That's a good job. And they keep the inning alive with a base hit, but you can see that's only the third hit. He's given up the entire game, so he's still in total control out two there. Out in now, Jack Conley, hey. as he will take a fastball in there at the knees for strike one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Rounded weakly down the line toward third. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. To one and two now. From the stretch. Three. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. So no runs on a hit here, no error. Stepping up now, Billy McGinnis. He's going to lead things off in their half of the ninth as they try to avoid the dreaded shutout. It's never a good feeling to get shut out. And over the course of the season... Now a dive by the right fielder, but it kicks off his glove. Dan, that can't bother you too much as a pitcher. Guy swinging first pitch. Now, one of the things you want to do, D. Rose, you have to try to get ahead with the first pitch. You want to throw one of the first two pitches for strikes. Unfortunately, sometimes when you bring the ball in the strike zone, you're bound to give up some base hits, but hopefully he can minimize the damage here. He's had to be sitting out over that outer half of the plate for him to take those first two pitches right there. Finds himself 0-2. I'll be surprised if the pitcher doesn't go right back to that spot. And the relay won't. Wow, you take me out. Two outs left. 
So, okay. Skip out of the dugout, making the slow trek to the mound. Let go. Anytime you can win a game, let alone on the road, you have to feel really good about yourself. It's not easy going into that other team's ballpark and coming out with a win, but they did just that. A 5 nothing finish tonight. The Akron Rubber Ducks led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Britt Strong gets yeah. the win on the mound his first of the year. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. For my partners, Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation yeah, of MLB yeah, The yeah, Show. Yeah, yeah. For oh, more, follow us on Twitter at name? MLB The Show. Okay. But whatever that noise is, you need to turn that off. It's annoying. Never. <laughs> Henry. What? That's Henry. <laughs> Henry, Never. Apparently, Henry apparently wants to get muted. <laughs> A minor league. Bye, coach. Henry. Brett, quit being a hoe. Stop it. You stop it. Today, who is this? I don't know who this is. Altoona. Okay. The game's future stars are on display as minor league baseball comes your way on the show. Tonight, it's the first of three to start the new week between the Altoona Curve and the Akron Rubber Ducks. The Curve look for their seventh straight victory next. Tez. Wait, he's not. He's in the Never mind. In now, Stefan Alamez. I'm about, I'm about to allow a hit pretty much instantly now, watch. First offering on its way. Underway here in the Monday opener as the game's first pitch misses for ball one. Fellas, you take a look at our homestanding ball club as they come into this one tonight. They come in playing well. Six and three over the last nine Henry, ball games, including a victory last time. So yeah, Matty, a lot of things no, trending I'll, in the right I'll, direction I'll hit the for this hit. team. They won their last yeah. game. They scored a bunch of runs. And let's see if they continue that today. To the plate now, Fly Madris. One ball, no strikes to count. The 1 0. Fastball. Right back. There's one. He's out. Over to Bowers, and it's a double play. Stop that. Never. Next will be the designated hitter, Will Craig. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. And he'll try to hold back the swing, but he'll do so unsuccessfully. Oh, this is, as this is the home run strike. guy. Okay. Rounded slowly to the left side. Scooped up. Throw in the He's dirt, out. but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Good job, team. Two flyouts and a pop up. Cool. Next will be the cleanup hitter, David Fry. 
Oh, David Fry, yeah. Strike taken as the curveball drops into the bottom part of the zone. Fouled off. Easy out, easy out. Plays it first. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. Talk about blowing it by a guy. Geez, I mean, that fastball was way behind him when the swing came through the zone. I have to think he was looking for something off speed, and he just couldn't pull the trigger on that fastball. Out in front of it, strike one. He got the fastball where he wanted and just pulled off of it. Really pulled that one across as the slider misses well inside. There's a swing and a high Fast deep up. drive headed for the There's right the field here. corner. And that yeah, nearly her, her broke ball. our okay. scoreless tie. Instead, it's a foul ball. Up, up, Popped him up. up. And two quick outs here in the second. Stepping into the box, Adrian Valerio. Day off for him yesterday, but back out there Aye. for this one. Fastball catches the black there for a called strike. <sighs> and nope. one and That's one as this one's in on the hands. That's Got not you. an easy yeah. pitch to do anything with, right? 96 miles an hour in on one the ball, hands. You almost yeah. have to be looking for that pitch to be able to do anything with that. Uh -huh. Fastball, fastball. Just hung mm. in there on that one. <laughs> He's a fastball, fastball. And this one runs in <laughs> on him as he can't get his he arms extended. That. It was right Great next to him. There and the okay. Is over. okay, team. Can you guys do something, please? I can't hold them off forever. Drew Robinson, now. the next to dig in. He comes in after a day of rest yesterday, so oh, we'll see if dear. it did him any good. Ball one to start the at bat. The one and zero delivery. Chopped up the line to first, but a foul ball, one and one. Now here's the pitch. Fouled away. Slaughter is going to be the move here. Hey, nobody out. Nobody out. The one, two. Hit hard to the right side. Maybe not. Foul. The one, two. Skied into very shallow right. Mine, mine. Brooks is in a few steps as he takes it for the first down. So striding forward now, Michael Jones. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And he waves at a oh, curveball there. One no down, balls in a strike. Hey. Hard stuff on the corner, and he's got him 0-2 now. Strike him out now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Now a swing and a miss. Anytime a pitcher locates a fastball on the inside corner, it's going to be a tough pitch to hit. That one was spot on, and he had no answer for it. Jason DeLay is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Here comes the 0-1. Lifted down the line in left. And they can't run it down. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. All set for the start of the fourth. And that'll bring in the second baseman, Stefan Alamez. Way behind that pitch. It's 0 1. I'd like to see this lineup start working the count a little bit more and drive up this pitcher's pitch count. Oh, Check out. swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. Now the pitch. Yeah. And he's keeping it down here, and that's one a ball, cold strike two. two strike. Rounded back up the middle. Reined in. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Riding in once again, Lima yeah, Driss. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Ball back inside. Just one hit apiece for one. both of these clubs. 
Didn't miss two. by much there, but it's just a bit high. Two and oh. And a good comeback two fastball one, there. It's two count. balls and a strike. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready or he's going to throw it right by you. Count even at two and two. Now here's the pitch. And that is swung on and missed. He's down on strikes. And the first two are retired here to begin inning number four. First pitch of the at-bat. Will Craig oh, is in with two away as he takes a ball, 1-0. Bases are empty here with two men out. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Well, this is a spot you'd like to be in, 2-0, good hitter. He's going to turn it loose right here. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to 2-1. And, and now pitch on the way. That's a He's ball. fallen behind now, 3-1. Three and, three and one. This is a good at-bat so far here with two away. If you're going to go down one, two, three, at least one. make the guy one. work for it. He's doing that, and he's even gotten himself into a good hitter's count now. Throw to Bowers is going to be in time, and the side is retired. Oh, yeah, there we go. Leading off the inning, David Fry. And they'll need him to get something going here. High and tight here to begin the inning. It's ball one. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here. Capitalize on the momentum his batters have. Sharp ground ball to third. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out. One away. Into the box now, Travis Swaggerty. He popped out in his first trip. Yeah, Matty, and it looked like he got fooled a little bit. A little bit out front, po ended up popping out. Expect him to be a little bit more leery of the breaking pitch to save him. Hit hard on the ground a second. He's got it. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And now, oh, this ball's going to wind up out of play. And a big mistake there. Wow, you see some throwing errors sometimes, but you don't see them from the second baseman that often. Looked like he was trying to aim it instead of throwing it, and the result is an E4. Adrian Bellerio will stand in for the second time now one, as he one, looks one. at a called strike. It's nothing in one. Throw gets him two down. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Drew Robinson. Flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 make so it far. Two you got it, you got it, you got it. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. So it's no runs on no hits. One error. Now to the plate, Michael Jones will start things out in their half of the sixth as they look to shake things up here for a lineup that, quite frankly, has been non-existent to date. No doubt about that. Matt. They've been completely overmatched to this point. One hit through five innings. I mean, what else can you say about the pitching they faced other than it's been fantastic? We'll see if that continues as we approach the later inning. Into the corner and slicing foul. The wind up and the 0-1. A great job of changing yep. speeds okay. there. It's 0-2. There you go, Man, this guy's really pitched well so far, attacking the strike zone, and he's really kept these hitters off balance. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. First pitch coming, here it is. Stefan Alamos is in for the third time now as he takes a ball outside. It's 1-0. Oh. Here we go, boys. Pitch on the way. Hey! Hey, this guy's done a better job than expected. He's made some bad pitches at the strike zone, but so far he hasn't gotten hurt by him. Seared down the first baseline, but this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. The one-two is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Make it six shutout innings as he continues. Ready now, Lima Driss. Hey, no hits no to this point. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. Yeah, man, he's locked in and pretty dominant since the first. So as long as he can get back in that groove with the next batter, he's not going to worry too much about it. 
And this ball is going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. This is on the ground over to first. A dive and he knocks it down. And no chance at a recovery here is despite a great effort that time, they won't get an out on I'm the play. I'm definitely about to get really relieved. At the plate now, David Fry, as he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Fly ball out toward left center field. Long run for the center fielder. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. And he'll move up to third now. Runners at the corners here with one away. So striding in, Travis Swaggerty. He's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Strike one to start the at bat. And it's quickly 0-2. Hey, roll up here. Nothing in two count and the pitch. The count is one and two. Big spot right here. That's a great pitch to try and see if you could get him to fish outside the zone. He's still in the driver's nope. seat right now, and I'd expect something else to miss off the plate. Even count, two balls and two strikes. On the ground is short. This could be two. Right to him. The second for one, but they won't get two as he beats the relay to first. Ready for another chance? Adrian Valerio. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. No balls and a strike to count. Sent on the ground out to second. Fielded cleanly. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. fireworks but that narrows the candidate list for our top player of the game and the man you see here was a key contributor so he takes it home in this one yeah Matty he definitely led the way you'll see there he turned in a four hit performance and that definitely keyed his guys to victory Oh, Brett. Uh huh. That was terrible, mate. What was? Uh, some of us <laughs> The way he played the game. A player oh. receives the check in from one of his coaches. Bruh.
Jesus. That was a low key hard. I love how the only one I didn't get there was the first one. That E hurry is a point five nine, that's amazing. Wow, that guy has a point four two. Time for minor league baseball here on the show as we set our sights on the Double A Eastern League. Tonight it's the third of this four-game weekend series between the Akron Rubber Ducks and the Bowie Bay Sox. It's Did they just say the Bowie Bay Sox? Grayson Rodriguez. Is that like funny? What the crap? Are you on call or something? No, I just had my myself muted for while I'm playing games and watching videos. Okay. At the plate, Peter Hernandez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. And he throws the fastball by him here, 0-1. Oh, well, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field tonight. They come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Yeah, Maddie. what I need to see out of this offense today is some early production. Somebody's got to get on, on base and, and put the defense on their heels. They've been struggling recently. They're not swinging the bats well. They got shut out yesterday, and this offense needs to adjust itself. Gunnar Henderson is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. That's a tough pitch right there. Curveball kind of front hit. Your first move is to bail a little bit and kind of not want to get hit by that pitch. I can totally understand him taking that first strike. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off-speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. Sent in the air out to straightaway central. Little, yeah. I got it, I got it, I got it. Mercado is there, two gone. Doesn't mean I asked for real help, Z. Doesn't mean he's not want good. Into the box now, Adley Rutschman. And he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Sent on the ground out to second. Throw in time, and the side is retired. And ending in the books tonight, still scoreless here on. So here's the cleanup hitter, Jamie Escalona, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And he fouls this one off. Here we go now. Let's go. The 0-1. Just behind okay, the fastball there, two strikes now. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Here comes another 0-2. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Really good late bite on that slider right there. The best ones have that late action that just darts at the last minute. They're so tough to get the bat on, and when you've got that good Hold slider going, count. it's a great strikeout pitch. Ryan Ripken out. is in with one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. one. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Eight, and he looks at two. one in there, one and two. One out, hey, one it looks out, like this guy's going to work in the upper part of the strike zone. It'll be interesting to see if this lineup can adjust to the way he pitches. High in the air down the right field whoa, line. Whoa, whoa. Johnson is over, and he puts it away in foul ground for the second out. Set to get his evening at the plate started, Ryan McKenna. And it's been a real struggle for him with the bat so far this year, looking to get things turned around in a hurry. Ready with the nothing and one pitch. One and one. Bottom of the second here with no score. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. 
And now that'll hop over the wall. So he'll be at second here with two away on a ground rule. That guy looks like a into the good box. idea anyway. Christopher Cespedes. As he'll take a look at a high strike that time, it's nothing in one. Hey, he started the what, offensive what, what? production with a bang right there. That's the first oh, hit. Over. And the throw is in time to get him to return. Riding in, Richard Arena, as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. And they go right after him on the inside corner for strike one. Borderline pitch right there. But as a low ball hitter, you can live with that as ball, long ball, as ball, the ball, umpire ball. doesn't give him north room, as well. Helton is there. Makes the play one away. Into the box, Malkin Canelo, and he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Hit hard to the right. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Man, if I'm on the mound right now, these guys are swinging at everything. Just want to try and paint the corners. Got him. It's so hard to hit when you're behind the count 0 and 2, right? You have to protect for the fastball. You have to look for the soft stuff down and away. You're really at a disadvantage when you fall behind 0 and 2. 0 and 1. Peter Hernandez will stand in for a second time here as he swings and misses there. It's nothing in one. Oh, he had him fooled there. No balls and two strikes. I know that feeling. Played 14 years in the big leagues and still can't hit a slider. It hard to the right side, but foul. So we'll see if he can straighten that out. The 0-2 once more. Gets him looking up around the letters. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. Three innings complete, and we are tied nothing-nothing. Call me up to, call me up to, to that double A, please. Or triple A, whatever it is. Now at the plate, Gunnar Henderson. He's 0 for 1 thus far. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle count. innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get him in, but that hasn't been the case. Both of these teams are garbage, so now. Okay. I'm not surprised. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Oh, that's well, this is an approach we've seen him use effectively lately. Set up the inside and then get him out with pitches away. Now a fastball taken outside here as it moves it to two and two now. Here's one that misses inside and the counts run full now. Three and two. From 0 and 2 to 3 and 2. What a great at bat to start this inning off. Hey, this could be a productive inning. And nope. a good throw gets him one go. Nope. Could be. Won't be. Settling in now, Adley Rutschman comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. In there, strike one. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Man, when you're struggling at the plate, that pitcher smells blood in the water. He's coming right after you, trying to end it quick. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there, two away. Hey, I'm not sure what he was sitting on right there. It might have been sitting on an off-speed pitch, but instead he gets the fastball way late. Had no chance to put that ball in play. Stepping in now, Jamie Escalona. As the first pitch ball misses one, to play. him, it's ball one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Now, here we go, guys. The 1-0 home. Skied into straightaway right. Right fielder giving chase. He can't get there in time, and now it hops over the wall for a ground rule double. Pretty good swing right there as he drives this ball deep. One hops over the wall, and he can just walk into second base. This ball's down, and that could bring in a run. And the runner at third will put the brakes on here as they didn't want to chance it even with two outs. Standing in now, Ryan McKenna. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. 
And they're runners at the corners now. Down here. Behind 0-2 now. Pitching has the upper hand early as we're scoreless in inning number four. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Riding into the box, Christopher Cespedes. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Just gets a piece of it, strike one. Here we go, boys. Swing and a miss, it's 0 and 2. 0 and 2. And he takes strike three called on the fastball, one gone. This pitching staff has done a really good job against this guy in this series. This is a really good hitter, and it's not easy to make a guy strike out five times in a series up to this point, but that's what they've done to this guy so far. Richard Arena comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. And boy, big problems here to start this at bat. It's 0-2 now. Woo, that was an ugly swing. If I'm pitching right now, I'm throwing that same pitch again. That was ugly. Hey, come on, guys. The next 0 2. And a good two strike swing here as he's been fighting off some tough pitches, but the count will remain at 0 2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. And he struck him out. Strikeout number eight now in the ballgame for him. That's back to back punch outs, and he's really starting to rack them up now, guys. I've got eight strikeouts in my scorebook for him now, so he's got good stuff. Bowers in foul ground. But it's the pitcher that makes the play. And that ends the inning. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Peter Hernandez. He'll lead things off here in this one-run contest. No balls and one strike. Down and away, ball one. And here's a pitch swung on and missed two one and straight. two now. Go right now He's gone to the well with that pitch three times in a row. I'm interested to see if Four he changes it up right here. The count now at two and two. Yes, yes, I did. Lifted down the line and left. Left fielder coming on. He can't get there as it falls in. Well. Into the box now, Gunnar Henderson, as he comes up empty on a pitch right down the middle for strike one. He's 0 for 2 in the ball game so far. Behind 0 and 2 now. Got it, okay. Fernandez aboard here at first with nobody out. Oh, he's able to get a glove on that one. One there, relay throw, but it'll be too late as he's well safe at first. Digging in the switch hitter, Adley Rutschman. He's grounded out and struck out in his two trips to the plate. One down, one down. Here's the 0-1. Grounded down the third baseline. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. Pulled toward right center field. Oh, you take it, take it. Two, two, Johnson two. is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Jamie Escalona. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an AB, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. And it's quickly 0 2. A runner on first with two away. 0-2 oh, pitch is a curveball that misses one and two. Hey, the fish ain't biting there on that 0-2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher might throw him another one. That's oh, ball. don't know how you lay off that one, but he did, and it's two and two. Boy, that's one of the toughest pitches to lay off a hard oh breaking ball at the back foot. Tough take on a terrific pitch. Here's the three-two. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. Oof. One hit, one left. 
Seventh inning coming up. Coming to the plate now, Ryan Ripken. A hit in two tries so far. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Eight. Oh, and one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Eight. Here's a fastball at the knees. Good spot, good pitch, and it's 0 and 2. I know it's cliche and it's tired at times, but a well located one, one, fastball one. down at the knees is still the best pitch in the game. And that's the first out. Now at the plate, Ryan McKenna. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Late swing there at the breaking ball. Must have been looking for something else. Hey, the guy on the mound is absolutely pounding the zone, and that's why he's been able to stay and pitch deep into this game. Behind 0-2 now. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. At the ball. If I'm in One the ball, box, you strikes, take a step yeah. out right here. Take a deep breath after that high fastball. you got to be That's leery of him burying something in the dirt. Two and two the count. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Count remains two and two. One out, here nobody right on. Now, and he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. He's just ringing up strikeouts left and right. But what's really impressive to me, he hasn't walked anyone either. He's just pounding the zone. His stuff is dirty today. Hey, now, we've got two. To the plate now, Christopher Cespedes. And he puts it on the ground to second. And that's through for a hit. There's a hard hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard single up the middle. Yeah, watch your lips right there, Dad. Sent it back right where it came from. Richard All Arena one. is in for the third time as he swings and misses at that one. It's nothing and one. Hey. Fastball, and he's quickly in the hole, 0 and 2. And yet another strikeout here. His 11th of the ball game, and this one ends the inning. So no runs here on a base hit, no error. Let's go. Yeah, and that's a sweet win, especially on the road. They took the lead in the top of the 13th and held on to it in the bottom to secure this win. Tonight's game comes to an end. 5-1 to one, the final score. Adam Scott earns his third win of the year in relief. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com.
A coach clues in a new team member on available resources. Manager confronts his pitching staff about an unacceptable team statistic. The show's continuing coverage of Eastern League Baseball is on the air. Tonight, the first of this three-game weekend series between the Bowie Bay Sox and the Akron Rubber Ducks. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Britt Strong gets the call for game one of the series. What do you have for us on him, Danny? This guy's one of the most dominant pitchers in the game, and how dominant? Picked up a double-digit strikeout total in his last start, and hopefully he'll bring that A game with him in the ballpark for this one. So digging in now, Gunnar Henderson, and we are set for baseball here this evening. First offering on its way. First of three here on a Friday night as the first pitch is in there for strike one. Fellas are home nine as they begin play here this evening. Four and two over their last six games, including a win last time out. Yeah, Maddie, this is a classic case of hitting is contagious. They scored a bunch of runs nope. last game, and this team is flying high right now. This is a fight at the bat rack. Not the warmest night you'll see around here, and even 50 degrees at game time. Johnson is there to put it away for route number one. Striding forward now is the DH, Malkin Canelo, and he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Owen won the count. The first here. And now pitch on the way. Swing and a miss, and he's in control. Owen two. So back-to-back -back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet another? Now a ball hit high in the air. Deep down the line in left. Hooking up, just a little. Up. Gonzalez is back to the warning track. And he's able to put it away for the second out. Hit on the ground out to short. Scooped up. 
throw to Bowers is going to be in time, and the side is retired. So not much happening here in the top half of the first. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one. No score. All set for the start of the inning. And next will be a speed thread in the form of outfielder Peter Hernandez. Into the corner and slicing foul. Big swing and a miss at the yeah. fastball, and he's behind in the count 0 and 2. And here's a curveball looked at. Strike three called, and that's the first out of the inning. Digging in, Ryan McKenna, and he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year, and it's fouled away. The windup and the 0 1. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. If this doesn't boost your confidence on the mound, I'm not sure what does. That's six pitches and two strikeouts in the inning, and that was a really nice fastball for the punch out on that one. Ryland Bannon right, is now. in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Gets a good piece of it there, but this is foul off toward the third base coaching box. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. So add one more name to the record book here as he strikes out the side on nine pitches. We're back to Friday night baseball. Standing in, Angel Aguilar. He's ready for his first at-bat of his early season contest. Hey, we're still in the early stage by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Standing in, Martin Cervenka, and he's looking to get it going. Off to a bit of a slow start this year. Hey. Fastball taken a little under the letters, called a strike. Nope, and down. low, it's a ball and a strike. Yeah. Slider bends into the middle of the strike zone, taken for a strike. Might have been taking all the way right there. That pitch couldn't have split the strike zone any better. And you can bet he wants that one back at the plate. So he got him swinging. Martin Cervenka goes down for out number two in the top half. Christopher hey. Cespedes is at the plate oh, now as he looks at strike one. That elevated fastball right there. That is the biggest change in the game today for me. When I first came up, a lot of guys working at Greg Maddox east to west. Mercado will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. New go, inning set to get underway, back, and stepping up as the shortstop, Gunnar uh, Henderson. Gunner. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. Oh, the last cool. thing they want to do is to try to come from behind. Is Gunnar being a savage bird? I don't know. Gunnar is not swinging. Driven nicely into the gap. Scratch up. He's around first, He's heading for two. Scratch what I said about swinging. He's swinging and he that double. He's second base with a leadoff double. Well, back in the day, you would hope your leadoff man can work a walk or leg out an infield single, but not in today's Aye. game. Now they expect the leadoff hitter to have a little pop, just like this guy. Nice leadoff double. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Good fastball down around the knees there, taken for a strike. Yikes. Yeah, this is straight no survival mode. Like down 0 2. The numbers are definitely not with the batter here. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. The throw to first is in time, one down. Now with the plate, Ryan Ripken. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. One and oh, the count. He has a good batting average. 
That'll be a souvenir, and the count will move to one and one. From the belt, kicks and deals. That's outside. One out and a runner on second base. Bouncer to the left side. He's right there. And there are two away now. Digging in for his second at bat, Peter Hernandez. He got called out on strikes his last time through. No balls and a strike to count. Tying run at the plate, the 0-1. Oh, and a good, good tight right slider right there. Here, He's in go. command, nothing in two. Hey, with first base open, oh. pitcher's definitely going to nibble and try and see if the hitter expands his own. Uh, got him on a good slider there. Swung on and missed as he's down on strikes for the second time tonight. Coming to the plate now, Ryan McKenna comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Swing and a line drive, but foul. 0 1 count, here's the pitch. Fouled off. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first out. Now in the box, Ryland Bannon looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. No balls and one strike. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. His command has been outstanding so far, hitting nearly all of the spots, and that's been a big factor why he's been one so ball, successful up strikes. to this point. A ball and two strikes now. The 1-2. One, one, hit to one, third. One. Reined in on to first, and there were two down. At the plate, Angel Aguilar. He's 0 for 1 thus far. First pitch of the at bat. Fouled away. Two out, nobody on. Grounded up the first baseline. But that'll uh, get foul. It's 0 and 2 now. You out. I think I should. Nothing in two count and the pitch. And he struck him out. His eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. So put another zero on the board. Oh, crap. Stepping into the box, Martin Cervenka will start things out in their half of the sixth as they look to shake things up here for a lineup that quite frankly has been non-existent to date. No doubt about that, Matt. They've been completely overmatched to this point. One hit through five innings. I mean, what else can you say about the pitching they faced other than it's been fantastic? We'll see if that continues as we approach the later inning. Easy fly ball into shallow center field. Mercado comes on now, and he has it one down. Stepping up to the plate, Christopher Cespedes. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. A ball oh. and no strikes. That one's going to find the seats. Strike one. Hit on the ground to short. And very quickly there, they're two gone to start the inning. So the lineup flips over. Oh, no, not Gunner. Gunner Henderson. One for two with a double on his line thus far. Gunner's going to head double on me again. On and missed 0 and 1. To first. Fielded cleanly. And Bowers will take this one to the bag himself, and the side is retired. Oh, well, he didn't do it. Digging in now, Malkin Canelo, and he'll get us started in what's officially the back third of this one. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. Owen won the count. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Hey, plays out one right here. 
And Three. he rings up another one. Make it nine strikeouts for him in the game. Digging in, Ryan Ripken. No hits to this point. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. The windup and the 0-1. Ball, that's outside. Boy, that's a yeah. nasty breaking ball right there. Yeah, Backdoor yeah. slider. Just missed the corner. As they say, that's a Hall of Fame pitch. One ball and two strikes to count. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. And he struck him out. So double digits now. Ten strikeouts for him thus far. At the plate, Peter Hernandez. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. A swing and a ground ball to third. Oh, and ouch, that one drilled him. Fortunately, oh. he's able to stick with it and get the out at first, and that'll put an end to the inning. Ready to begin the eighth, and next it'll be the outfielder, Ryan McKenna, rolled slowly down the third baseline. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Here we go. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. So stepping in, Ryland Bannon. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Good bike to the slider, and he takes strike one. His slider's been impressive all night long. If he can continue spinning it like that. There's a swing and a ball hit wow. in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one, without a doubt, is gone. What a great feeling Crap. right there. Is Robert Broom is into the ball game now as he'll make Let's his... Play ball. You're out. He's out. Three. Full four. Take your break. Three. Ball four, take the yeah, and in this game, you always try to find a way to be hopeful. They win the first game of a new month and are now looking to keep it rolling the rest of the way. Tonight's ball game comes to a close. Three to one, the final. The Rubber Ducks jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Britt Strong takes the win on the mound his second of the year as he allows only two hits through seven plus innings of work. Kirk McCarty wraps it up for the save his fourth of the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleszak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way on over to theshownation.com. Hello? Huh? Hello? Hello? Yes. You both are quiet. What's up? Well, yeah, because I'm, I'm watching YouTube, you know. I'm actually... I don't know. How about to pass out, huh? Her. Oh. So, I can't really go to sleep, because if I do... I'm gonna end up snoring and she's gonna end up trying, probably waking up. That's why I usually go upstairs to go to sleep while she's in her room. Oh, well, John Burks and Trenton. So who do I need to watch out for in third hitter and fourth hitter? Okay.
She just moved. <laughs> Minor League Baseball is live and ready now. Woody Lopez. And we are ready Woody for some Lopez. daytime baseball. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch Southwind. up with it. It's 0-1. Woody Lopez. Fellas, you take a look at the home side here as they take the field mm -hmm. this afternoon. They come off they another loss last more. time out. And in fact, cut. they've dropped three of their last four. Yeah, man, nothing they'd like to do more than to salvage this one, d -Roll. After this one, they go on the road for a seven-game road trip, so big to get this win here today. Yeah, last game in front of the home folks before you go out for a week. This is a big one. They're going to get it done. Now a swing and a miss on the slider as the leadoff man is set down on strikes to open up the ball game. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. Nice. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Jason Dominguez is in with two away as he takes a ball 1-0. Oh. Pitch on the way. Hey. Left it up in the zone, right. but it's a strike one, ball, one and one. Strike. They teach pitchers to keep the ball down, but if you can locate upstairs like that, it really gives you the ability to mess with the... And the center fielder is under it to make the catch, and the inning is over. Nothing doing here in the opening half inning. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one. No score. Yikes. Hey, Brian, I'm going to leave the party for a little while, and I'll try to rejoin Second later today. To we know you're not going to rejoin. And next rejoin. to hit is the catcher, Kellen Degley. I just want to go and take my eyes out for a little break. No, that's low. Bad injury. Yeah. Bad break. Zip on that one as he just throws it by him. I didn't say bad, I said ball. I know, but yours bad. Okay. Hold high in the air out to right field. Long run for the right fielder. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. So coming to the plate, Chris Gittens. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Ah, that was an awful. Fastball well outside. Awful, awful. Awful. Pro. Oh, yeah, that was one as well. No score here as we play inning number two. Come on now, here we go. And a curveball's ball. by him that time as he falls behind now one and two. Got him to chase after the curveball below the zone there. That was a really nice pitch. And it can be a really tough one to lay off of as a hitter. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Chris Gittens goes down for out number two in the top half. Cameron Meisner stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. 0-1, oh, here's the pitch. Nope, ball one. Pitch swung on and hit in the air toward the line in right. And that'll get down for a base hit. The throw into second. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. One hit in the inning, but that gets erased. At least we scored. Now batting, Trey Ambergy. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season oh. contest. Third inning underway oh, now no, as no, a no. curveball misses here to start things out. It's 1 0. Oh. And it's a called strike to even the count at 1. Ain't no one down here. Mm, clearly fooled there on the slider. Rounded weakly toward third. He's got it. And the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Stepping in, Anthony Volpe. He's ready for his first at-bat of this early season contest. And he gets ahead 0-1. That's a tough curveball right there to stay into as a lefty hitter. That ball looks like it's almost going to hit you. And it breaks over the inside half of the plate. Behind 0-2 now. In the air out to oh, the left. I was so 
Gonzalez is gonna get there as he backs up to put it away. Yeah, and there are two gone now. I'll tell, tell you that. That was Here's Caleb Power. Else. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Someone's still watching me. I don't know who it is. One. Shocked he didn't let it fly right there. Mm -hmm. Usually you're Probably looking for a fastball elevated to get the party started. Oh, oh, that's off the Here's a breaking ball, but it doesn't quite find the strike zone. But she hey, texted me whenever she was just going there. So I don't know to run who it is. Into O2. And he fouls this one off. Bases are empty here with two men out. Inside, inside pro, inside pro. Swung on in the dirt, strike three. Helton goes to get it, and that ends the inning. So they go quietly here in this half inning. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. The Rubber Ducks lead this one one to nothing. set for the start of the fourth and that'll bring in the second baseman Woody Lopez hey we're still in the early stages in this one they're only down by a couple of runs but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started <laughs> first pitch of the at bat Aye. pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here capitalize on the momentum his batters have off the oh, outside that. that time as the breaking ball can't now. catch the zone Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. This is lined to left. He lays out for it, but he can't pull it in. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. You've got to applaud the effort there from the left fielder. It just didn't work out as the ball squirts by him, resulting in a double. That's the danger of leaving your feet in the outfield. Scooped up. And there's one away. Digging in to try again. Jason Dominguez. He flew out in his last at bat. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. That was an awful pitch, and he still swung at it. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control 0-2. Two mid-90s fastballs right there that he doesn't seem to think he can catch up to. I wouldn't be shocked if he came right at him again with another good one. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Jason Dominguez goes down for out number two in the top half. Kellen Deglin is in with two away here as this one swung on and missed for the first strike. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. What the hell? Now with the play, Chris Gittens. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Oh, I didn't. First pitch that, of the he's the only one that didn't offer ball ball anything. I have to do fastballs. Hey, that's a nice take by the batter right there, but that's a non-competitive off-speed pitch. Got to do better to at least entice a swing. <laughs> no contact there, there and it's one and two. Right. Yeah, this I was thinking that as well. You better get that front foot down early and get ready or he's going to throw go. right by you. Throw on to first he's is out. in time to get him. So that'll go down as a strikeout and a two to three put out for out number either, one. Either it's your sister or either it's Ben. First pitch of the at bat. Who? Your friend. My friend. Ben. Ben. Faces are empty, one man out. Oh, Ben. That Ben. Yeah. I have another friend in Ben. Ben. Okay. Behind 0 2 now. <coughs> You know, come on, the one that, that, that yeah, he's caught me. Ah, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. Man, this guy's on his game today, not only when he's throwing strikes, but how about the amount of strikeouts? And what's even more impressive, no walks up to this point. So he's pounding that zone with strikes, and he's making these hitters swing the bat. Swing and a miss here, and he's behind in the count now, 0-2. 
Hey, offense needs to check itself right here. They need to make this starter a little bit more uncomfortable. One strike. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. So nothing happening this time around. I uh, whoever that person is is not commenting. So Stepping I know it's not in, Ben. Anthony Volpe. He He'll start anything. things out in the sixth for a lineup that oh. really hasn't found its groove oh, in this one. Yeah, only two and hits so far, well. and not very many hard hit balls so either. We'll see if they can start well. making some adjustments. Oh, much too uh, tardy on a fastball. One Henry. and one. Uh, I don't think it's Henry. Hey, let's go right here. Does Henry does the same thing? Yank the yeah, slider across but... that time, laid off for a ball. He said he hey, they tried to tie him up on that pitch. last pitch, so I like that they went away with this one. The execution didn't work, but I like the idea behind it. The 2-2. Two -two. Now a flare out to left center. Left fielder coming on. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. Caleb Cowart. Digging in. Okay. Caleb Cowart. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Not surprisingly, here, this is on the ground to the right side. He's a designated hitter and for Trent the bag himself for the out. They, you know something funny? So the batting this order team is, is over this now. This team is trying to sweep to us. And they're down for enough in, in this sixth inning. They'll follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. I'm about to Strike get called up most likely. Skied in and straight away right. Talking trash, they about hit home run. Johnson is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Open. Digging in once again, Thomas Malone. And at this point of the game, I so, think it's clear that the plan run. of attack against the top of the order has worked. Well, when you've only surrendered one hit and to the top no three guys in the order up to this point in the game, you know you're doing something right, Matt. You're spot on. Whatever they discuss coming into this game has worked out beautifully. Slow roller down the third baseline. Fielded cleanly. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Ready once again, Jason Dominguez. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Hit on the ground out to short. He's got it. On the first, and it's a quick start to the seventh. As now there are two away. They need to, they need to work the count a little bit. I'm not tired yet. Now, Kellen Deglin. That means I can go another inning. First time around, and then was a strikeout victim most recently. Oh. Fastball too high to start him out here. I'm working the count. I'm working myself. Up yep. top, it's two and zero. Oh. Here it comes. And a good comeback fastball there. It's two balls and a strike. Hey, it's tough when your team is being held scoreless on the scoreboard. He was trying to put him on the board with a swing like that one. Three and one to him now. And it's fouled away. Now the three and two pitch. Slow roller left side. Reined in. Throw to Bowers nice. is going to be in time, and the side is retired. In now, Chris Gittens. He leads off their half of the eighth, and they've been unable to get that starter out of the game to this point. Yeah, he settled in early on the mound, partly due to the lead his guys gave him to take some of the pressure off. He's taken that and pitched very effectively in this one. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. Okay, nobody out now, nobody <coughs> out. On the ground to the right side. Uh, it's flagged down deep in the hole. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Stepping up now, Cameron Meisner. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matt. He got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way to make this pitcher work a little bit harder. A high fastball is in there. Man, this guy's really pitched well so far, attacking the strike zone, and he's really one, one, kept one. these hitters off balance. Scooped up. Throw gets him. Two down. Oh. 
So striding forward now, Trey Ambergy. And they're down to their final four outs here, Dan. Yeah, and it's not looking too good for them right now, Matt. They've got a significant hill to climb, but they've got to take it one bat at a time. A couple of guys get on, and then who knows what could happen. Eight, Strike two, two on the curveball. 0-2. Oh yeah, if he's going to pound the zone with this stuff all game, the offense better step up. Somebody's going to have to pull a trigger a little bit earlier in the count. Come on, guys. Grounder down the line at third. But this will be a foul ball, and it's still 0-2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Stepping into the box, Anthony Volpe. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Here comes the first pitch. One, one, one. Little chopper down the first baseline. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Into the box now, Caleb Coward. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. That's out. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. So far this season, Coward is slugging a little under the 400 mark, so the chances of his connecting with the ball right here aren't particularly good. 2 0 count and the pitch. Hey! Hey, this guy's done a better job than expected. He's made some bad pitches in the strike zone, but so far he hasn't gotten hurt by him. Unable to get the bat around in time, and the count evens at 2 and 2. One. Hit back up the middle. He's got it. On to first, and they're an out away. Two gone here in the ninth. Riding in once again, Woody Lopez. He's their last shot here with two away in the ninth as they look to avoid the shutout. Yeah, Matt, they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching so far in this one. He makes the catch, and they will salvage at least the finale in this three-game series as the ball game is over. Yeah, they could only manage two hits against him the entire game, so they were never really in a position to even challenge him. Rock-solid win and a memorable performance. 5-0 the final score today. The Akron Rubber Ducks took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Britt Strong wins his third of the season as he allows only two hits over nine full innings. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. To find out more, head over to theshownation.com. games good games I'm going to bed